Okay, welcome back to our Yamaha XS500 Cafe Racer build. Today what we're going to do is deinstall this rear tail light, which is just massive and sitting way up here on the back of this fender that we're going to throw away anyway. I'm actually we'll put that on eBay. And then we're going to take this small round tail light and we're going to mount it right down here by the rear brake. Um, we're going to fabricate a bracket and we're also going to install the uh, license plate so everything's one complete unit nice and clean look back here and uh, we'll get some tools out and start fabricating okay I've been busy fabricating with aluminum and what I have here is the main bracket for our tail light and then the sub assemblies to hang our license plate off the back of that and then to mount up on our motorcycle now this half inch is easy to bend and fairly easy to drill. If you have a power drill, I'm sure it works a lot better or a drill press would be great. But I've got everything drilled up and all I have to do is uh, show you how to assemble this and mount it on the bike. So this is the main bracket. This is the hole that mounts on the bike itself and then these here mount right on the back of the light. Now each of these little tabs that hangs off the bottom will hold one corner of the license plate. So all I have to do is put these bolts in, one in each side. I'm not sure what size they are, they're uh, probably metric. This is a, actually a Suzuki tail light. So we'll get these uh, screwed in, get this all mounted up for you. Okay, um, again, these are metric. I don't have any metric tools, so uh, this works just as well. Um, if you don't have a crescent wrench, the next best thing is uh, vice grips. So that's how the bracket looks. Again, it mounts on the bike like that. So we're going to hang the license plate right off of the bottom of this. Um, right like that. Um, I don't have any bolts, so we'll use these uh, zip ties. And a tip, if you use the colored zip ties, they last a lot longer than just the clear or the black zip ties. Um, I don't know why, they just do. So we're going to put those on. Just like that. Get it cinched down nice and secure. And then right there we have a completed assembly, which will look like that from the back of the bike. And next we'll get this thing installed on the back of our Yamaha. We've been working on our taillight bracket and license plate bracket. We have it all mounted up now. What I did is I took that hole that I drilled and I took the bolt off the shock and I remounted the plate with that same uh, bolt that holds the shock on. So now we have a nice clean uh, installation and we've got that little light instead of this uh, giant light that was hanging off the back of the fender and it hangs low and it incorporates the uh, license plate and I think we nailed it. So we can check this off the list and move on to the next project. I'll talk to you then.